morning, I am doing my final step in setting up their morning baskets properly. <laughs> it has been taking me so long, but that's okay because they've been working on their morning baskets. It's just that I haven't had everything set up like I wanted to. Um, so today I thought I would share with you what is inside of their morning baskets. And this is going to be ever changing, I'm sure. But for now, um, I'm just showing you how we use our morning baskets. It's morning basket time. So they are actually working on their morning baskets. And she chose coloring in her Alice in Wonderland coloring book. These are actually Avery sticker labels. They're glossy, clear, round labels that I had gotten for our business. I was going to be using them to put size stickers on our tees to ship, but I ended up um, choosing not to do that. And when I was thinking about assigning points, so basically our morning baskets are just full of stuff that I think that they would enjoy working on in the morning. And so each thing to make it more purposeful and to encourage them to try out each different thing, I figured it would be great to assign a points value, a token value to each item inside of their basket. So that is what I'm using these for, is to assign a specific token value to the things that are inside of their baskets. So right now, I'm just laid out here with all the stuff and I am trying to grab the labels and assign the point value to each one of them. So as you can see, this is in my oldest son Cameron's um, morning basket and this is his investigator's Bible. So just to encourage him to make sure that he's in his word, he would receive 10 tokens for spending time in the word in the morning. Okay. I'm just going to show you everything that is inside of their baskets. So I'm going to start with Kendall's morning basket. I got these several years ago from Target. I stocked them until they went on clearance. I don't even remember how much they were once I finally bought them, but I love them. So I have this black and white striped one, and then I have this... Um, white with the black at the bottom this is his basket and i'm going to go ahead and put his things back inside each of their baskets i've been trying to put a game inside so inside of his is the game silly street so the thing about the game is that they need to find one of their siblings to play with and then each of them gets this amount of token um silly street is worth four tokens Okay, the next thing that is in his is this best ever word search with 365. Um, I showed you this. I showed you most of these things in um, my haul, in my haul that I just did, but one page inside of the word search is worth four tokens, if you can see at the bottom right hand corner. Oh, and I also wanted to say that a nice tip for um, filling these really good <laughs> word search workbooks out. Um, so that you can reuse them is to use highlighting tape. They can use the highlighting tape and it's just fun for them to use highlighting tape and tear them off, rip them off, and get them done. So when we taught summer camp, um, they have these summer bridge activity books. So I have this summer bridge activity book. This actually came from when I taught summer camp. My kids actually took their work from home to do while we were at summer camp so I could keep moving through our school year but um they still receive these books so we might as well just go ahead and do them so i have the token amount down here is six if they complete um two pages in this book the next one i have is another workbook and it's the same thing six tokens if you complete two pages in this book then he has his action bible and he just has to spend some time reading through and he has to communicate to me what he learned and based on that he will receive the 10 tokens that it is worth. So you can't just read something and then say, you know, it was about this. It has to be some type of exciting revelation attached to it <laughs> in order to receive the full 10 tokens. So there's that. Okay, now we have their watercolor palettes, and this, they can 
um, create a piece of artwork on their own, whatever they're led to do, or they can, um, they also have inside of their baskets these dot to dot or these coloring pages and they can use these to add to the coloring pages or the dot to dot pages. And if they do, they get an additional four tokens for doing so. Can you guys see me in these watercolor? <laughs> There's tiny me all over the place. Anyway. Then, well actually, let me show you what I mean, um, the dot to dots, which I showed you in another haul video. Kendall, can I see your dot to dot, babe? So he's working on the dot to dot nature scenes here, and this is what I mean. So after he completes the um, dots, completes the pictures, then he can use the watercolor. And I'm to trying to complete a picture with 515 dots and it's a flower i finished three leaves already okay and it is worth did i put the points on here yes i did i'm not doing this because i want to get a token i know but you received tokens because you participated this one is worth eight tokens and he once he completes the dots by choosing to add some watercolor to it so that would give him a total of how many tokens 12 <laughs> uh, yep next thing that's inside is this story for kids he's just supposed to be reading his way through this one and it is worth 10 tokens and then the last thing that is inside is actually not worth tokens this is just his read aloud so this is for his quiet reading time currently um they are responsible for reading 25 to 30 pages um, and Savannah, Savannah, how many pages do you have to read? I don't think she has a page count because normally she far exceeds it anyway. So I just don't, <laughs> I just don't even give that to her. I just let her read for the amount of time that we're reading. And she generally goes above that. So that is everything that is inside of his morning basket. And there he is finishing up his morning work. Oh, and he also has his own special Scrabble that he got for his birthday. So that is inside of his um, in case he wants to play that too. So we have two versions of Scrabble. Okay, now that I talked quite a bit through the first one, this should be easier to just kind of go through the rest of their baskets. And also just in case you might be new, um, the first one that I went through is for my younger son, Kendall, and he is in the second grade. This one is for my oldest son, and he is technically in the fourth grade. So the first thing I have in his basket is his version of Scrabble, and it is worth four tokens. Next up, I have this Optical Illusions. I'm pretty sure I got this from the discount bargain store, Ollie's which you guys know that I love. Um, and this one is worth eight tokens. This one is pretty cool. Oh, man. It comes with the pieces that um, help you do the activities. This one here. This one is about the leaning towers. And it just talks about visual optical illusions. So um, if he goes through and reads it and does some of the activities and writes it up in his um, notebook, then he would receive the eight tokens. I have this one. You've seen this already in the last haul that I did. This is the Draw Really Cool Stuff and it is worth four tokens. I'm not exactly sure the level of difficulties with all of these things. If some of the things are a bit more difficult, then I, I have no problem upping the value of the tokens or pulling it down if I find that it's way too easy. Um, he has his Summer Bridge Activities workbook, six tokens. I really like these workbooks and I should have gotten the fourth grade bound, but I don't have it. <laughs> so um, we haven't worked our way through this one completely. So I just want him to continue to work on it until it is done. So it is worth six tokens. His investigator's Bible is worth 10 tokens. And this is his watercolor. He was gifted this 
really super nice set of watercolor from one of our faves, which is Vanessa Brantley Newton. We actually went to go and visit her. And just in case you haven't seen that video, I will list it above so you can check it out. I love it. It's one of our special memories in homeschool and I hope to do more things like that. He got this set from her and this is worth four tokens as an add-on to um, anything else that he's done inside of his work box. He has the plans I have for you journal. I, I've shown this on another video. We really didn't complete much inside of it. It is worth 10 tokens if he picks this up and um, fills some of the pages out and just is able to um, communicate to me what he has learned and any insight that he received. And then he has his read aloud, which right now it is the dreamer. Um, he is enjoying it so far. It is not worth any tokens. He just has to make his way through this one and fill out his book report. The last thing he has is what he's actually working on right now. Can I see yours, Cam? So I can show them? Um, so he basically has the same dot to dot one. He is working on... Oh, I turned it around the wrong way. Dot to dot famous places. So that's what he is doing. And it is worth the same amount of tokens as the other one, which is eight. And then if he can add on by doing watercolor for four more tokens, which would give him 12, 12 tokens. You got it. Here you go. And now for my daughter's morning basket. First set she has is just a set of four books that she has been working through for a little bit of time. I need to switch them out, but I just haven't done so yet. And then I have no problem with her reading them over and over again. So she gets four tokens for completing all four books on her own. The next thing she has is this Play All Day. It's a book of punch out and play games, toys, finger puppets, boxes, and more. So it's just something that she can um, punch out and play with. She can write a story to go along with it. She can have a puppet show, a paper puppet show if she wants. So whatever she'd like to do with them, she receives four tokens for just having a little bit of fun with that. This highlights um, hidden pictures, discovery, puzzles it is worth eight tokens for her she has to find the parts and then she has to spell the words of the items that she found and that is how i made it worth a little bit more the next one she has is the summer bridge activity book and it is worth six tokens she has a veggie tales bible i am still on the hunt for a super cute um bible just for her same deal she has her watercolor palette and it is worth four tokens and this is her devotional it's not one that i selected it was just one that i received and it's good enough for now until i can find something that I really like and it is worth 10 tokens. And then she has her read aloud, which she finished this one already. So this is just a placeholder until we receive our book outlet order. I have been obsessed with book outlet. I wish someone had told me about it sooner. I don't even remember how I found it, <laughs> but I love it so, so, so much. And I'm getting ready to show you everything that I've gotten as soon as that order comes in. But um, her Sophie Mouse books are coming in and she can move on to the second book. But this is the one that she just completed. And my kids are in the background sniffing up a storm. <laughs> Oh goodness. Anyway, this is her game, which is the Spotted game, and it is worth four tokens. I'm going to toss that in there. And then she also has what she's working on now. Can I show them what you're working on? So she is working on this one. This is the last thing that's inside of her um, basket. So it's called Color in Class and... Classics. Oh, Color in Classics. Um, Alice in wonderland a coloring book a coloring book right <laughs> every picture tells a story so she's currently working on that the very last thing that's inside of their work boxes is their um their pencil cases so they are supposed to be being good stewards over the things inside of their pencil cases um, basically what's inside is their highlighters their glue stick their big eraser um their pencils, their expo marker, and then they're supposed to have um, note cards, but I don't know where her note cards are right now. <laughs> and same thing inside of the boys. And then, of course, their morning binders, which I will show you in another video. 
Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please make sure to give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Make sure you're subscribed so that you can get notified when we post again. And we will see you in the next video.